So when you're creating a form on HubSpot to capture information about your contacts, usually you'll be able to select uh, one of or a few of you know HubSpot's default properties. Now let's suppose you have a specific question that you want to ask, such as you know what's your favorite food, um, and let's suppose you want to add this to one of your forms that you create on HubSpot. Now obviously HubSpot is not going to have a default, uh, uh, you know, a default property called favorite food, right? You have to create one. So this is where you do it. You go to settings and then you click on properties and go to create property. Once you're here, you're going to see a right, la um, a right sidebar um, popping up. And um, so let's just do step by step. Uh, object type. So this is information about a contact, right? You want to know the favorite food of your contact, of that person. That means that it belongs to the group contact information. Um, what is the label in this case? Label is really the name. It would be favorite food, right? Um, description is optional. You don't need to add that. So if you're adding this specific question to a form, it would be interesting to select which kind of answer people are going to give you. You can give them different options. If it's just, you know, you put there a, a, like a little box, people would be able to write whatever they want. Now, if you want to give them, let's say, three options, chicken, ice cream, and pizza, um, the best field type for this would be a um, drop-down select, which is a menu. So in the form, uh, when you're doing it on HubSpot, this property will automatically appear with three options, ice cream, and then um, what else did I say? Chicken and pizza, right? So your contacts, when they are filling out your form, they will be able to select from one of these three questions. And as soon as a new contact comes in, HubSpot automatically saves this information for you.